So, what are you doing? Well, I got a bunch of these red chilies, and uh, I'm cleaning them up. I'm gonna make some red chili sauce that I can use, freeze, and use throughout the year. Maybe show uh, Kevin a thing or two. Kevin, the restaurateur. Something about these red chilies here. Why don't you just go out and buy some regular chilies? Like already roasted? Yeah. No. Because, and that's what a lot of people like to do, because it's easy, uh, you could end up with something like this, which goes over there, and not in the chili sauce. You know, you never know what's in the what's in the bottom or the middle of the box of chilies. You might have a you might have a mouse in there and end up with a fire roasted mouse in your chili sauce. What I'm going to do with these, the big ones, is I'm going to throw a bunch of them in the smoker and run some smoke over them. It's heavy. I need to be waiting for that. Kevin? Alright, shut up. Okay, we're going to hot smoke these over some uh, pecan that we stole from a KOA in Texas. Here's what we got going. on here. Don't know what I'm going to use them for, but here we go. No water, just peppers. And some salt. Okay, this is about maybe 20 minutes. Look at all this. This is just nothing but it's pepper water, sugary, super sugary. But uh, it's this isn't this isn't the same stuff that, that we do with uh, dried peppers. You know, 20 or 30 or a bag of dried peppers and water and let it simmer. It's not what this is. It's not what it's for. So we need to slow cook this. Uh, for quite a while, maybe an hour or two, uh, until them, the skins are really loosened up, everything is completely separated, uh, and you don't want it to scorch because you're not going to be in there stirring it all the time, and the only way to accomplish that is with lids. So what you end up with, those two five gallon buckets of peppers, is three products here. This one is, uh, it's a really sweet, syrupy, hot liquid that is kind of the cream of the chili there. I'm thinking hot and sour soup, not, I'm thinking barbecue. This here is all the the uh, the pulp without the uh, stems or without the uh, skins and the seeds and this is uh, really excellent for chili Colorado red chili uh, barbecue sauce barbecue base <laughs> and this uh, this over here is kind of It's uh, a little useless for eating. The um, reason is, is it's mostly stems or uh, skins. It's 11 o'clock now. 
you know, so this takes time. Uh, skins, uh, some of the seeds, and a lot of the uh, really, really fibrous stuff. A uh, couple of spoons in your fish head stock. Mix it up with your uh, lobster shells. At any rate, freeze it in sandwich bags. Portion it. But uh, this right here is probably the kindest red chili base. Ready to go. Portion it out and freeze it.